The Power Food Truck Park in Mesa is a popular place to hang out, sample good food, support local business. Tonight, the future of the park is kind of in limbo, right? The Mesa City Council put off a decision on whether to allow the food trucks to keep serving in that popular spot. Jason Berry joining us live to explain what's going on there, Jason. Well, food trucks are extremely popular these days, especially in East Mesa, but growing concerns about trash and noise has neighbors hoping a food truck hotspot go someplace else. This used to be a big empty parking lot. Now it's a cool hangout where food trucks flourish and hundreds of hungry diners arrive six nights a week. Sounds fun, right? not for the homeowners who live close by. The reality of it is that there's places for things like this. Right? David Sloan is one of two dozen plus neighbors asking the city of Mesa to not allow this food truck park off Power Road in McKellops to stay here permanently. The motorcycles and the car alarms and you know all of the people and when, when people get together they shout and they cheer and they have a good time right having a roushous barbecue in your backyard uh, six nights a week you know it's that's that's what I live next to. The Power Food Park popped up during the pandemic in the spring of 2020 and has been gaining in popularity ever since, often attracting more than a dozen food trucks a night. The Mesa City Council has been asked to rezone the land to allow the food truck operations to continue on a permanent basis. A vote on rezoning was scheduled for this week, but council members put off the decision, leaving the food truck park in limbo. We were a little disappointed that the council was waiting to act on this, um, especially the holiday season, representing so many small businesses in Mesa. Uh, we want to be able to get uh, our development plan underway and have a permanent home uh, for these food trucks and to have a uh, community space. The city has cited the owner for having trash and debris, but the owner insists steps will be taken to keep the area clean and future events won't run late at night and music and noise will be kept in check. One neighbor has set up an electronic billboard on the roof of his house to let visitors know how he feels about the food truck park being in his backyard. It's not that, hey, you, you know, people leading to the food truck, you're doing the wrong thing and I hate you. No, it's not that at all. You know, it's that, hey, I appreciate you guys are having a good time, but recognize there's an impact, right? Clear when the Mesa City Council will readdress the zoning issue, but until they do, the food park, we're told, will continue operating as they have been running. Reporting live, Jason Berry for Arizona's Family.